That training center has already paid off for some students who are continuing their education. WCBI's Alyssa Martin spent time at the center today. She joins us in the studio now with more. Alyssa. Andrea, more than 2,000 students have already taken the Work Keys test, and around 1,200 have completed the basic manufacturing skills certification at that West Point training facility. And now both of those are needed to be considered for a job at Yokohama. Today, I spoke with some students who have moved on to the next phase of training. Jackie Hubbard is busy sharpening her skills at EMCC's training facility. Her many hours of training paid off when she landed a job at Yokohama Tire Manufacturing. I started at Yokohama as an operator and I moved to a team lead and from a team lead to a supervisor. The training she's working on now is practical skills, which will help her continue growing in her profession. She says she is thankful for the training center and the opportunities it has given her. This facility means a great deal to me. Um, with this training, it shows me a lot as far as how the production world, world works, and it prepares me to go out and do the job the best that I can. Clint Smith is also employed at Yokohama as a production operator. He says the class has not only been fun, but also helpful. I really enjoyed it, and it really benefits me, your knowledge of hydraulics and pneumatics, and it's been a lot of fun. The training center helps prepare those interested in manufacturing jobs. EMCC leaders say it's a way to bridge the gap between what's available and what's needed in manufacturing. We are the vehicle for training people so that they can get the requisite skills to be gainfully employed by not only Yokohama, but the Packards, the Steel Dynamics, and other advanced manufacturers in our region. And if you would like more information on that training center, just visit our website, WCBI.com. All right, Alyssa Martin in our studio with that story. Come